done. Okay, okay. let's head out. I can escape Ooh. through that pink window there. I can choose different uh, equipment for killing things, and I can't afford any of them, so we're not. Oh, we need to get more Cthonic keys. No turning back. Anything? Uh, what is escape? Oh, okay. By escape, they mean start the game. I I see. Really That's him? a little different from. Okay. In the name of Hades, any... Olympus, I accept this message. <laughs> Greetings there, young man. Look, your father's always been rather difficult, and he's not so much as called in quite some time. You'll have a better home where you belong, here on Olympus. And to help you on your journey, have my blessing. What the hell is this? Is... what? Is... What? I'm trying to understand why Zeus thinks that like, thinks that Hades is prince. I don't even remember what this guy's name is. His home belongs on Olympus. Uh, I'm gonna just assume that it's typical Zeus things. <clears throat> okay, do, 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 boon of Zeus. Ah, so the first time I got Athena's blessings, this time I'm getting Zeus's blessings. So that presumably changes the gameplay somehow. Your cast is a verse of chain lightning. Your attack emits chain lightning when you damage a foe. That seems pretty good. Never thought I'd see the. I like that a lot. Night, whenever. Oh, Uncle. Okay, so this time my attacks do not cause any deflections. I'll need to keep that in mind. That was an Athena thing. Wanna die again? Um, Chthonic means having to do with the underworld. Okay, uh, you know, you can go ahead and submit your best definitions to try and trick me into thinking that Chthonic has a, has a definition. Um, it's not gonna... You know, it's clearly a made-up word. But you can try. You can try all the same. Of course, you know, saying it has something to do with the underworld while I'm playing Hades is, uh, you know, it's a pretty, it's, it's a pretty generic move. Um, it's convincing, though. It's a safe, it's a safe, uh, troll. What is this? Oh, that's plus 10. That puts me at 40. I'm almost at that one thing that I forgot that it sounded really good. Oh, it's extra dashy. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, as long as I get to clear at least one more room, I will be able to dash twice once I die. That seems like it was probably a really good uh, worthwhile use of my time to prevent myself from getting a power-up on this run. But hey, I basically beat the game the last time I played it, so, you know, we're just gonna... All I need to do is just 10% better, and we'll have beaten the entirety of Hades. Sounds great. All words are made up. I mean... Okay. So, the, the thing about language is that language is... It describes the natural world. And the natural world is also described by mathematics. And, like, first order... Your lightning attacks also makes foes jilted. That seems really good. I take damage your foes struck by lightning. Not really too interested in that one. So, do I... Dash, or do I stun enemies? All right, Lord Zeus. Um, we'll do stunning. Sure. Anyway, so yeah, like, like logic, first order logic also describes the natural world, and I don't really remember what the sentence was where I started all of this. So, the point is, I'm probably right, and yeah, that seems. That seems to check out with me. Cool. Uh, Jolt is pretty strong. Well, I'm glad that I read that message well after having chosen the upgrade. So, yeah. You know, that's really kind of your fault for not giving me that advice quicker. If you really think about it. Like, I get that there's a delay in the stream and whatnot. But you should really try to understand, um, you know, the way that I think and or don't think. And just kind of make these predictions ahead of time. All set. I just... 
Be better, chat. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> okay, what do we want here? Ooh, more pomegranates. Yes. I'm hoping that the game will eventually teach me what these different symbols mean. Ow. Because it would be kind of nice if I had any inclination of what was a good idea or not. Um, so that I could learn, you know, things like, okay, if I choose to go in a room with this symbol, I'm taking an extremely high risk, uh, like high reward route, which is a really bad idea to do if I have like 10 health. But the point is I'll be able to make informed terrible decisions instead of just, you know, blindly choosing bad ideas instead. The whole point of risk assessment is to know uh, how much swag you're going to get out of it, not to actually make good calls. Let's see, your lightning effect also makes bulls jolted. That, there we go. That seems good. Press for boon info. Uh, yay! There's a whole chart of things. Oh, 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 okay, okay. I see it. I see it now. So... There are those four icons m correspond to different things that I can do. I guess the bottom one is dash. The top one is a passive, I'm guessing, on my weapons. And then the other three icons probably have meaning if I were to ever experiment outside of just doing passives on my builds. So I think I'm understanding now. So purple is just a generic, like, you'll get level up kind of room um you know you get like those purple things that it was able to well okay bye <laughs> i think zeus came in to you know give me a little bit of a helping oh is that jolt oh that's my dash okay so my dash was doing something again um don't really ex exactly remember what but I guess if I'm dashing, let's hang on, hang on, let's read that. Uh, okay, I didn't, I didn't, um, I can't, I can't really see it because I don't know if I can pause. I feel a little bit scared pausing. Uh, that's, oh, okay, so my dash didn't actually, I didn't, okay, I didn't actually pick up that one skill that makes my dash do, do stuff to the enemies. Or maybe I did. It's not appearing on the left-hand side, so... Eh, whatever. I don't care anymore. Uh, what is this? I can get heart, which kind of looks like one of those Pokemon badges that you would get from defeating a gym leader. So I guess this thing will let me... Okay. Lizalfos. I can work with this. Yeah. Okay, the point is um, to, like, kind of like, go a little cross-eyed in this fight, and just kind of use your peripheral vision to understand that, you know, a whole bunch of shit's gonna be, like, falling on the ground, and if you just kind of let your eyeballs, like, be focused and, uh, think about, like, you know, what you need to cook for dinner and stuff like that instead of focusing on the game, you can go through it without taking any damage, Hi, except for the damage that I probably took. I accept this message. Why, hello, <coughs> my little godling. I have to say, you're quite the specimen. Oh! So I've decided I shall aid you for the moment. You interested? Yes. Yes, mommy. <laughs> okay, so... We can do... Either a rare upgrade, a rare upgrade, or an epic one. When foes are slain, they damage nearby foes and inflict weak. I, we, I'm going to assume that epic is probably the best of these. Special deals more damage and inflicts weak. Uh, this is a blast radius. Hmm. I already have a lot of abilities that can do some kind of AoE-ish things, what with the ability to do the chain lightning stuff. I'm wondering if I should have an ability that does more direct damage in case I'm fighting a boss head-on or something. I don't... What is my... What? Okay, so I can press Y and that's a unique attack. This curse victim deals at least 30% damage. 
On the other hand, a status effect that makes everybody deal less damage to me seems pretty pretty dang doodling good. Interested in the power to I think cards. we're gonna go with that one. Sure, I don't see why not. Alright, what's my special ability? I don't know what this is. I'm gonna try it out in the next room and I'm gonna find out. Hey, a Hades Keys. Or what is it? Uh, a cathartic, um, a cathartic, uh, thing. So, I thought, uh, a, a cathoid ray, uh, um, key. Whatever they were called. You know, the one that, the one that's a fake word. Hey, kill that guy. Uh, Bird, how are you so good and also so bad? The point is to not care and just rely purely on instincts, but don't actually go through the process of developing your skills. Like, just, you know. Wretches. Exactly. I, that's that's how you do it. Okay, I can work with this. And it's a, it's a special attack. Uh, the thing I didn't level up, I'm using exclusively special attacks now. Huzzah! Boom! Okay, I was able to see the effect of the AoE there, so that seems pretty decent, except for the fact that the radius on it isn't really all that big. So, I guess I'm going to have to... Here, this will be good. Just use the AoE there. Uh, that was... That seemed kind of awesome. It looks like I did a little chain reaction thing of enemies setting off uh, AoEs. From the dead. So that's uh, yeah. something to keep in mind as a really, really powerful Don't ability that I apparently out. have. I'll try to keep that in mind. Get this boy. I see your relatives upon Olympus get you out of this. Uh, oh gosh, ow! Father. Survive for 43 seconds. Okay, I can do that. Uh, see, I'm already, I've already done like 39 seconds. Wait, no, the opposite of that. 45 minus 39. You know, the numbers. The basic arithmetic. I learned it in elementary school. That's, it's been a long time. I haven't had to do math ever since then. That's not true currently studying for uh, a bunch of linear algebra crap. Ah! It's job game dev interview job prep work. Would talk about it, but busy thinking about how to not focus on the Good game. Enough. Finally. And we did it. This can unlock a weapon back at home. Okay. Got me. That's no way to to keep going. I can get better money. I can get I can get more money, or I can get something that will help me get through the rest of this floor, I'm guessing. Let's try that. Let's see what happens when I go over here. And boop. And boop. And AoE ow. It's okay. I think I selected the ability that I that lets me heal up a little bit after each room. Oh, wait, hold on. No, I looked at that ability and then chose not to get it. Well, it's fine. The past is the past. My decisions from the past can't possibly come back to have any influence on the present. That's why all that stuff's in the past. See? Max life. Perfect. Okay, more pomegranates. Excellent. I can use the pomegranates to make my sword stronger by applying its, um, CV strength. Good, good. And that guy should have, should have known better than to mess with me. I'm wondering when I'm going to get to see new enemies, because so far, I haven't actually seen any new foes in a little while. I mean, I'm guessing the thing is that I haven't, um, so a lot of these enemies Strength. I saw, uh, when foes are slain, they do that, that seems really good. 
The lightning effect also makes foes, foes jolted, and that does more. I think I'm going to level up this one. Yeah, because I'm applying a lot of chain lightning to things already, and I'm assuming that the extra joltage will probably synergize well with my skills. Maybe. I'm not really too sure how to put together an actual build. I'm just kind of guessing. Ooh, here we go. So I can get some more health, which is probably the best idea. I can get this thing, which I don't know what it is. And I can get a key, which is good because that's a meta progression thing. So probably want to do this one just because I don't get a whole lot of healing opportunities at all in this game. And we'll pick up the key. Hey, Sharon. Just dick man boat, man. Sure is awfully convenient to be running a deal like this. I had all this coin I wanted to get rid of. Not much of a talker, Beyond is he? That's probably because he's got a coin up his tongue. Tartarus. Promising terrifying dangers far beyond the underworld prince's reckoning. And I can reckon quite a bit. Just tidying up a bit. Or Sharon's face is melting off. Uh, it could be both. Oh, I'm scaring all the ghosties. Eh, it's fine. There's nothing to be afraid of once you've already died. What are you going to do? Die harder? Like, <laughs> that's stupid. There was already a movie called Die Harder, I think. Halt, Sagrius. Not one step further. Bless you. Megara. <laughs> Come on, Meg. Haven't we had more than enough of each other by now? Besides, don't you have someplace else to be? This is X. Your father sent me. All in all, I'd rather be on your bad side than his. Now you can turn back like a good little man, or I can send you home the painful way. What'll it be? Painful, painful, painful. I'll have to go with the painful way. Say the stupid thing. It's what we're all here for. You know, just because I'm don't... Just because I have a brand doesn't mean I want to promote it, okay? That makes common business sense. We don't need that around here. A man after my own heart. She kind of looks like a JoJo character. Don't you think she's looking like a JoJo? She's got, like, wrong colored lips. And then, you know, she's got, like, faces on, lines on the faces. And she's all buff strong. She's, she's, she's kind of she's kind of looking like a JoJo, in my opinion. All right. Megara. Ow. Okay. That was unexpected. It looks like she did something. Oh, she just did a dashy attack. Okay, we'll get away from that. She's gonna do a dashy. Getting close, hit her a couple times. Back off for the AOE. Mess it up. There with it. Um. Okay, we wanna kill some ads real quick before they become pain in the ads. Oh, okay. Get away from that. Uh, she's gonna do a dash. Hit her a couple times. Gonna get away from the AoEs that we have to deal with now. Uh, gonna hit her while she's doing that attack. So she's gonna do a dash. I can just hit her a couple times. Back off. Damn it. That was, was way fast enough. Okay, I'm probably gonna die. Dang it. Okay. Oh. Died on the first boss of a log of a log like rogue like. That's never oh, supposed to happen. Epic. Hey, where's Hypnos? Someone's at the desk next to the throne. Hey, where is Hypnos? Hypnos was my favorite character, I think. They were the one that... Hey, lad. What? You... you can't get, bring Hypnos back. Change.org position. position How goes it, Shanks? I really should have listened to Mother, Cause of Death and Palement. What is this? 
Is this telling me, like... Is this... My, is that my last cause of death or something? Because if so, I don't need the game rubbing it in my face. Keep at it, lad. I've known great men throughout my life, and I can always tell when someone's better than their circumstances. Fight like I'd fight out there. Dude's got nice hair. I'll give them hell as you once did, Achilles. Though, doubtless, many of the shades who stand against me first arrived in Tartarus because of you. <laughs> Think that was a joke. Renovate? Renovate. Some sort of special offer for me, my good shade. Is this a chow garden or something? Uh, can I afford any of these? So I can restore some heart amid the gloom by... Okay, this one's free. I'm just picturing this is going to be like Farmville. Like, this feels like this is the perfect in-game currency. The fountain chamber in the depths of Tartarus sounds like an excellent idea. What's that there? Something from the fates? No. No. Okay, well, I mean, I can get my credit card and we could throw down 20 bucks to get, like, the platinum pack or something if it'll take me to the end of the game. Who's that sniveling shade to your immediate left there, father? Already found someone new to do the busy work. And here I thought I was utterly indispensable. <laughs> We're all a family at Hellcorp. That shade boy is my newly designated contractor. One whose responsibility is to work on this house. Though who shall pay for everything my subjects here demand, I do not know. You're trying to guilt me into funding the exorbitant furnishings you desire. What? Are they... Do they take contract law real seriously or something like that? Who's... Who is Hades accountable to that he has to, like, make sure his books are in order? He's the Lord of Hell. He's already an accountant. Perhaps once we are finished with repairs for all the carnage you have sown throughout my realm, then we might finally have time for all the needed renovations that have piled up. Nice. <laughs> nice. Darkness guides you, child. You have outgrown this house. Of that I am now certain. Should you return again here, I shall keep you safe. Why does she flip all her words around? I won't forget you, Nix. I swear it. Nix, comma, Stevie. Cool. cool, cool, cool. I didn't actually get a whole lot of purple stuff this playthrough, so... I didn't get... I, I mean, it's enough to afford the greater reflex, but didn't really get anything else. I'm gonna get more damage when I hit stuff from behind. Uh, yeah, okay, we'll do plus one HP every time I See enter you, a new room. Get myself some more Catholic vitality or whatever that was called. I should go. Oof. Uh, use thingy to unlock a new weapon. I think I'm gonna just hang on to these because I like my weapon as is. I don't really want to. Uh, ooh, look at that! That looks this. really cool. First, get past the wretched shades of Tartarus. Easier said than done. And doubtless, I'll be running into Meg. The river of flame ought to be just beyond. Find a way up to Elysium from there, and after that. Alright, let's give it another shot. Okay. Uh, different weapons, evil, different play styles. I am not confident enough in this game at this point to experiment with different play styles, so we're gonna just keep it as is with the sword and just keep leveling things up from there. Uh, okay, so I made it to the first boss. From what I can tell, there are probably four bosses. He said something about like going through this area, then we go, then we fight Megan, then we do something. Time to go. You know, I wasn't actually listening at all, but I think I counted to four when I was listening to what he was saying. So that looks like a Daedalus hammer. Oh man, a Daedalus hammer! I've always wanted a Daedalus hammer. Enchantments for my weapon. Bow and shields are much more noob friendly. I mean, I'm not a noob. I'm new to the game, but that doesn't mean I'm a noob. That gives a big chop that deals 90 base damage. That doesn't seem that great. Uh, hold attack strike more rapidly. 
dealing 25 base damage per hit. Your special hits a wider area and deals 20% damage. I kind of like that. Daedalus, wherever you may be right now, thank you. Okay, I don't know what this does. Oh, it's just a regular special. I see. That, that part didn't change. Um, okay, that's not good. That's not a very good start to this dude. Just immediately take damage on the first enemy. In my defense, I was trying to think of something to say funny, uh, something funny to say about Daedalus, but I actually couldn't think of anything, so that sucked. Composed of such innumerable, ever-shifting, interlocking chambers, the underworld of Lord Hades all but guarantees the dead shall there remain until the end of time. Good thing I'm not dead. Yet. I mean, he's a god. Do gods die? I don't really know. Whoops. Whoops. It was broken before I got here. That's just a thing that happened. Not my fault. Yeah, I was... I don't actually know what the Greek god Daedalus is. I just know them from Deus Ex as, like, the AI. Like, the, the nice AI. In Deus Ex, there was a mean AI and a nice AI. And Daedalus was, like, the nice one. And then you're playing through the game, and you're talking to Daedalus, who's, like, a nice little AI that's like, Hey, bro, I, like, knocked 20% off of your, um, you know, internet bill or something. And then you're, like, sneaking through a, a sewer, and then all of a sudden this, this other NPC comes on, and he's, like, assuming direct control or something, and it scares the crap out of you. Brimstones. As much as anything can scare the crap out of you in that game, on account of the fact that it's an incredibly confusing game, and... Uh, you know, all it basically is is somebody read a whole bunch of, uh, conspiracy theory forums and was like, I'll just, uh, take all of them and make them all true at the same time. Thought I won't miss a couple coins. And it's actually a very, very awesome game. Uh, pretty sure God can die if you stab him enough. I mean, I didn't read a whole lot of antiquity as I established earlier, but as far as I recall, I don't think that there was a God of stabbing a bunch. So, if there was, then I guess that would, God would be the person who uh, takes over the entirety of the underworld, huh? It, just uh, by pure, by pure stabbing. That'd be a very, very <laughs> hilarious, um, but underwhelming uh, ancient mythology thing. Too. If it was like, and he took over the ooh Zeus. We'll do Zeus. Wait, no, no. Oh, wine is Athena skills. I see. So, the Athena skills might give me, like, the, um, the, the dodgy, dashy. So that would be, uh, probably pretty rad. Especially if I get something that upgrades it to be, um, deflecty. I think, wait, hold on. Did I, did I just pay attention to the game enough to discern one of its mechanics on my own? How is this game so intuitive? I do not know. I guess it is based on a combination of Binding of Isaac and Diablo, both of which I played a certain amount, so shouldn't be too bad. That was revelry. People having a good time. Wine is not Athena. Well, Damn sure. it! It's um, the name of Hades. Bacchus. I will accept this message. Hey there, Zach. Oh, it's this guy. How's it going? Look, you have got to get here with the rest of us already. <laughs> we will save you a spot. Let me see what I can do. Make life a little sweeter for you in the meantime. Okay, this is pretty awesome. Hi, Dionysus. Your special inflicts hangover. Bacchus is Roman. Ah. Okay, well, thanks for the correction there. Victim keeps taking... Wait, so hangover is... Okay. Okay. So hangover is a um is poison, huh? Okay. That rocks. I can deal with that. We'll do it. Leave it to the god of wine to lighten things up around here. Anyway, Dionysus is uh Let's ooh. see what's in here. Deal forty five percent damage. Special attacks deal plus forty percent damage for six Ah, these are time. Okay. We will hold off. No reason to. No reason to do that. Ooh, we get a room with a with a 
Well, we're gonna find out, but it seems pretty exciting. Your Highness. Hi. Hey, Princess. Must look like I'm slacking off with the old boulder here, but I was just getting back on my feet. The Fury Sisters don't often leave me be. Where'd they go, anyway? And, um, what are you doing here? Oh, uh, you know, just out on a little stroll is all. Do me a favor, though. You see the Fury Sisters. Let them know I was headed down the way I came from, will you? <laughs> oh, man. Please tell me I'm able to, like, help this guy push the boulder up at least a little bit. Oh, I'll let them know, all right. I hear you loud and clear, Your Highness. I'll just go about my business now, and you take care. Let's see. Vertically offers a choice of benefits. I can heal up a little bit. Lose it all for express... What? Oh, oh, I thought it was saying that his offer was to kill me. And be like, hey, I'll take this from you. You can go back to... You just go back to, to Hades. Darkness, probably want to do that. For purchasing items during escape attempts, all is lost on death. For purchasing darkness. Say no more. Plus 60, Cheers, that's man. rad. Come on now. That's like... They basically twice as much as I, as I currently have. Sisyphus. You gotta get to push him, bro. This boulder isn't gonna push itself up the hill. Careful, Bye. What a nice guy. Let's go, lads. Okay, I can work with this. I've already fought these guys, and the last time I fought them, I don't think I even took any damage. And if there's two of them, that means it's just basically spam that AO AOE. I almost said that AOC. And, uh, I mean, I'm not r slash white people Twitter, so we're not going to be doing that. Boop, boop, boop. I is there... Is there any reason why I shouldn't just be spamming my AOE, at least with the current build that I have? Because this seems pretty awesome. I mean, I guess it probably doesn't do as much damage, but it certainly seems to be doing all right. Boop, boop. Wow. That seems pretty awesome. And there's only one heavenly archer I know of. Well, so really. <laughs> anyway, in, in the name of Hades, <laughs> Olympus, I accept this okay, message. Okay, heavenly archer. Um, heavenly archer. Heavenly archer. Lord of the Hunt. Uh. Act. Uh, Artemis, right? Actim Acteon. I don't. I, for whatever reason, I can think of the French name, which is Acteon. <laughs> Artemis. Look, I'm not like all the others on Olympus. Uh. The power of the hunt helps keep me company, so maybe it'll help you too. I'm not like the other girls. I got two horns. The attack is stronger. Deal critical damage. Or er, dash strike deals more damage. Attack is stronger. True shot. Cast for a powerful ranged attack. Retrieve hit to keep using it. You know, I haven't ever used any of my cast things, so I guess we'll do... The... The... Keep it simple. Let's, uh... Let's do the hunter dash, sure. That seems the good. Power of the hunt sounds like good company to keep. Ah, what I wouldn't give for say a healing flask of some sort. If only I had a feel a healing flask. Is this going to be like a recurring joke in the game that there actually is no healing flask or something? Because if so, that would be hilarious. Uh, Andrew is apparently a big simp for Artemis. That's hilarious. She does have a good design, but. I mean, she's not as hot as Megan, or Meg, Meg Gary X, or whatever her name was, who, you know, she's a JoJo character, so it's a pretty, it pretty much can't compete. Uh-oh, uh-oh, this is fine. AoE, AoE save me. Okay, okay, good. More? Can work with more of these guys. Not too concerned. Slightly concerned. They're dead now. Not concerned anymore. Boop! Alright, that was easy. Let's 
let's see, get some coins, not too interested in coins, or go to the shop, more interested in shop. Let's go to the shop. That is also basically a free healing by going to the shop. Okay, more health is probably a great idea. What? Uh, oh, so that's like much more cost effective health. So this is really expensive health. This is cost. This, this, this is cheaper health. Or I can get more power. I'm thinking I'm gonna go with become more powerful. Don't spend it all in one place. If you're quite done with shopping, Zagreus, let's say we cut straight to the chase from here. Okay. Yeah, the real reason is I went with this one with the sip more for part of us. Let's see, let's see. Uh, attack is stronger, deal critical damage. Yeah, sure, why not? More passives. Why ever have active abilities when I can just become passively really, really strong? The infernal wares of the Stygian boatman Charon lie sprawled about. Available for sale to whomever would be willing to quench the boatman's great thirst for riches. That would be me. Hi. Hey, good to see you out here, mate. It looks as though you've got some fine wares up for sale, don't you? I can gift him that. Right trigger to gift him a thingy. I guess I'll do that. Why not? Kiron, you've been such a reassuring sight, I thought I'd offer you a token of my gratitude. Wait, you don't have to give me something in return. It was a gift. Though, you're insisting, aren't you? Is that like a Karen thing? Is that... wait. His name's probably not Karen. Uh... We definitely have a bit of a different disposition slash demeanor if he was a Karen. Yay! He gave me a know what to say, mate. Bone hourglass and a heart popped out of him. This game is Farmville. I can drop thirty dollars to buy a bunch of Karen coins or something and then give it to him, and then it's like I can use that to grow bigger broken hourglasses. Am I interrupting something? Mm. That wasn't good. Probably don't want to do an AoE in the middle of uh, where the enemy's going to be doing a dash. That was very, very piss poor planning. Oh my goodness gracious, I am doing very badly. Uh, I think I just have a... I think I'm... I think I got a shit build. <laughs> I, think, I think I just got a... Uh, Got a not very good build. There's way too much. I think I have way over spec on AoE. Um, I mean, I have a matter of to learn how to play a little bit more effectively with being this heavy on AoE. Um, but I don't think I did a very good job with this character this time. Whatever. That's health. Health is good. I need a lot of health. I got none. Oh, no. Oh. Get it. Nope, not here. You're thinking of somebody else. I'm not here. Got their attention. Well, okay. So here's something kind of nice, though. Um, if I'm in a survival room, that does probably mean that most enemies here are going to be a little bit weaker, which means that um, AOE is probably going to be uh, more useful in this room than previous rooms. Um, definitely don't need to be as accurate. Ah, damn it. Yeah, this was an awful build. Yeah, being that heavy on AoE was really not uh, a particularly great style for me. Maybe it's maybe it is good usually, but that was not something that really played to my strengths or the way that I understand this game. Not a fan. Wow, wasn't that amazing? Like, comment, subscribe. It really is the best way to support the channel, and it'll give me encouragement to keep on going with this stuff. So, uh, I'd really appreciate it, and, you know, thanks for watching.